I'm just a pretty, pretty normal dude. Um, I think if you see me, you just come up, and talk to me, and uh, you notice I'm just, just like everybody else. So, I just like to, I like Wisconsin. I'm from here, obviously, and I um, enjoy being here. So, just like, just like everybody else in the area. He was a multi-sport standout in high school, then became a star receiver for the Badgers ending his career tied for the school record in receptions. This summer, Jared Aberderis found himself in a crowded receiving core in Green Bay. Aberderis dreamed of being in this position, but he also knew it would take patience and dedication to get there. There's different parts to setting goals. I mean, um, a lot of people like, say, hey, what's your season goals, things like that. But, you know, first you got to get to the season. I mean, um, you're in a competitive business, so it's you know, during the off season. there's different goals that you set, set for yourself. Whether you want to work on, you know, weight, weight gain, whether you want to work on speed, quickness, um, strength, and, and you kind of set up, set up a plan with your goals. Um, and then once you get to the, you know, actual start of the season, then you got to reset your goals. There's much more than football in Aberderis' life. Jared and his wife Rachel have a young daughter whom he loves to see before and after work. She's awesome. Every time I go home, it's just fun to have her, you know, run to the door, give me a big hug. So it's definitely the, the bright spot of the day. As a dad, Jared might have a little less time to get away than he used to, but he loves the peace and quiet of nature. I like, there's anything outside, really, hunting, fishing, you know, just going to the lake, swimming, just hanging out, I guess. So uh, anything to get away from the, the busyness. You know, when, you, when I'm on the woods or on the lake fishing or doing whatever, it's just, it's peaceful, quiet. You can kind of uh, relax and um, just kind of clear your mind a little bit. Abradera says being a pro for an athlete or anyone else is about more than just what you do while at work. Obviously, you have to have the talent to be at this level, but um, there's a lot of talented guys that are, you know, not in this position because, you know, they didn't take care of their business off the field. And that's, you know, whether that's in school or, you know, doing stuff they're not supposed to. Um, so being a pro is um, you know, not just about the talent, but it's about taking care of everything that goes on in life um, besides you know, your sport or your profession.